that said, I love carpets, me. Yes. Yes. When you're sick and tired of council pop. Yeah, yeah, I know. Landlord super. It does bop. The song is an extreme bop. When your face is as long as Livery Street. Park life. Landlord super. Um, when the job displaced persons. And your face is full of frowns. Come out. Pogs are falling out of me old mugs, bruv. Okay, pause this up for a second. I gotta change the game name. What's your opinion on the new pornographers? I like them, but I like Destroyer as an individual more. Yes, I remember. We got... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. I'm not sweating this. Thank you. Okay. We got some keys for the construction site. Job center. I remember you. Okay. We Can we look at our notebook? It is hard to look at the notebook. I'll give Malf that one. So if you're not familiar with Landlord Super, basically it's a, we inherit a piece of property. It's a piece of absolute garbage. We also have no money and we live in this caravan. So we want to try to like fix this place up and rent it out. It's a little bit like my summer car. I mean, I know you're saying it must be nice, but like wait until we get through here. Also, turn off the CRT effect. I'm going to level with you. I didn't know that was possible. Saw it off, will ya? You appear to be trying to break into my sight. Look here, our kid. I got here first. You can come get your little bit after I'm done. Besides, if this is your sight, then you'd have the key, wouldn't you? Hey, you really do have the key. Ah, blimey, kidda. I was only trying to find a bit of scrap to sell. You know how it is after the pit closed. Ain't much work about like. Okay. Uh, I'd love some help. That's what I thought. Tell you what. You need any help? Come see me over in the Anchor Tavern. Nice to meet you. There we go. So this is our garbage flat right here. So I know you said it must be nice, but like to be polite, it's not move in ready. So we don't even have enough money to take the bus. So step one, we're going to have to do like some odd jobs. Just sprint to the town. Og walk to the town. The cars will hit you, by the way, so just be a little careful. <laughs> Here we go. We've made it. Yo, the place isn't even open. He's waiting in queue. Social distancing. I got a spot of work for you if you're keen. Just head on over to the job center and grab the ticket I posted. Once you've accepted the job, head on over to where's written on the location. I'll be waiting for you there. The job center is next door to this pub. We're in. Is this the... Okay, this is the delivery driver. I can't take that yet. An open-minded individual to help me move some items. Not a problem. How did you get hit by a car? I jumped out of a bush. What do you want? I'm here about the job you posted. Finally, someone else who's keen to earn a, a few bob. Here's the deal, then. Old Sheffingham Council has condemned this place, so I'd say it's about time we got in here and took our little bit, eh? What's that look? This is enterprising work I'm offer you, offering you. Mrs. Thatcher would be proud. Sure, the only annoying thing is it's not strictly legal, but that's the only annoying thing. So how's about it? You want to help old scouse here see what we can strip out? Okay, what do you need me to do? British people be like, it's Tuesday? I can't deny is is good. I've seen the TikTok people reading British people be like tweets. British people be like I'm British. 
I've seen it. Flippin' heck, me back's gone. I can't believe it. I'm in no state to be lugging scrap about. You'll have to do the work, kinda. Look, it's real simple. You just need to go in there, grab three scrap, then chuck the scrap into me wheelbarrow. I should then be alright to take it to the scrapyard. I'm gonna take a breather here. Okay. I remember, remember, I did this part. It took me a lot longer to do this part the first time, but... Okay, so just drop this in here. You'd really like it to stay in the wheelbarrow. I think you get more money, but... You know. You can't always get what you want. You need to do a Scouse accent? I'm not Steven Gerrard, okay? Oh! No, 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 you can't just throw it in. You gotta place it in. Use the interact button. I mean, it's not so easy, dude. Oh, there it is. The bathroom sink. Can I have a boa o wa I can make fun of them. It's literally punching up. They have dominion over my country. Ah, spot on, kidda. Spot on. Annoyingly, I can't pay you till I've weighed this in at the scrapyard. But I'll get the money to you by post first thing tomorrow morning. Not much else going on around here. Just the Anchor Tavern is open for midday. But if I were you, I'd just go to bed. No use feeling forlorn when there might be more work popping up at the job center tomorrow. Avoiding all work. Because there's none available. I've listened to... I've listened to Park Life. Okay. So, how'd you... How'd you do that? I would like to go in, though. It's not open yet. Hold on. I'm fast as frick. So, let's go... We grab the delivery driver job. And then when we walk out, we go... Hey... Are you that desperate? Go on then. You got a driver's license? Stop that. Okay, here's the job. Thanks, you saved me. You're not going to regret this. So I believe he gives us the ability to uh, throw garbage out. The only other thing we can really do is like we kind of like walk around, maybe steal some stuff. No oh, way! There you go. Yeah, he gives us the ability. I mean, there's not much. We can't do anything at the pub today, so we we'll just walk around and like steal some shit. This guy gives us the ability to place orders, and does it? Hold on. You in there? You are in there. So what can I get you? Nothing by. How about you? Don't you give me something? How's about it then? You new here? You must be the chap something something. What can I get you? Nothing by. Okay. So now I think like... Maybe we can find like just some garbage that we could steal and pawn at the scrapyard. I could use it. Oh. Yo. Drop that. We don't need... What do we got here? Building sand and cement. Cement is easy money, dude. Is this the scrapyard, by the way? Is this where we sell stuff? Maybe. Okay. No. Okay. That's cool, too. That's cool, too. I understand. You can use it on your house. You put it... Oh, you put it on the skiff. Thank you. Maybe use the wheelbarrow. Hey, Panda for Rice, I don't have a wheelbarrow yet. If you know which houses on Dory Lane have a wheelbarrow in their backyard, in it, I would love to grab some. But for right now, I'm a little skint. I have zero pounds and zero pence. Looking for girls who like boys who like boys. If you're not playing this, I mean, this is from the 80s, right? I don't know. You should be listening to, like, New Order or something instead. Um, 
Anyway, let me in. Toss this down on the ground. Speak to this guy. He's driving on the wrong side. A hey, up, man. Look, I know we may have had a little falling out or whatever, but you've really helped me out here, so thanks a bunch, men. The skip should be unloaded already. But so you've got an idea of how this works, just tell me when you're done and I'll head back to the supply store. Once I'm back, you can make more deliveries. You don't even need to visit the store. You can just call us on that phone over there. I'll get paid either way, but once 1900 rolls around, I clock off and you're on your own. Anyway, thanks again. Feels really good to be back in steady work. Cheers, pal. He almost hit me. So I think we could put the cement in here, but we could also just go to bed. We, we can do some odd jobs tomorrow. Take a quick shower first. Why, why are you doing a New Zealand accent? Well, we can't just make fun of the British. We can make fun of people from New Zealand as well. People from New Zealand be like, thank you. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> Thinks again. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, they're all asleep right now. Yes, we buy scrap, chuck it into a skip, and we'll send you money in the post. <laughs> no, we're not. You got me there, I suppose. This wheelbarrow's all yours. Let's go. You can use it to lug scrap to the tip where you can sell it for some dosh. Can I get a translation, please? <laughs> can I get some Can I get some fush and chops? What is that? Is that Valley Girl? I love to eat fush and chops on my deck. Dosh equals money. I know that. The dosh are their money. I've attached a brochure to help you out. Thank you, thank you. Fush and, ch fush and chups. <laughs> Marinda, I just wanted my fush and chups. It, does, it doesn't feel right. I'm more of like a... Marinda, where's, where's my fish and chips? I don't know. Maybe I don't have that one. Maybe I don't have that one. Uh, yes. Now, today, we become a dishwasher. Do Scottish? I cannot do a Scottish accent, which has never stopped me from doing an accent before. However, I can't do a Scottish accent because I literally don't know what words to say. Like, Australian, you're just like, Oh, scrape powder out there, mate! You get, like, a Crocodile Dundee snowboarder sort of thing going on. Scotland, I'm like, I got no idea. A kind of... <laughs> I kind of go through the drive-thru. It's like, yeah, it's like, I, I, I don't know what the words are. Like, there's an accent in the text. All right, this place isn't open yet. Hold on. There's no <laughs> words on it. Clean pots and pans. No experience necessary. Got it. Anything else? Nothing else. So what do we do for the rest of the day? I don't think we do anything. I think we just take a seat on the bench until noon. You can steal some stuff? Yeah, but then I gotta walk it back. <laughs> it's a long trip. <laughs> Get out of here. Oh, hey, they still... Okay, what time is it? 10 a.m. I can walk it back. I mean, come on, it's free sand. You're right, I should have taken the briefcase. Or, not the briefcase, the wheelbarrow. Forgot what job I was doing. Do a Canadian accent? Oh. Buddy's two goals short of a hat trick, if you know what I mean. Something like, it's like... Minnesota plus redneck is the stereotypical Canadian accent.
And I'm like, bud, I'm not going to math class. You know what's a uniquely Canadian insult? Is calling someone a goof. That's, like, I should not be giving you the words of power. Because Canadians have kept it a secret for so long. They think we call each other, like, buddy and hoser. But if you really want to get under a Canadian skin, call him a goof. What are you fucking goof? Go back to the silly string factory, you goof. I'm telling you. It, if you... If you want to anger a Canadian... Tell them they lost the War of 1812 and then call them a goof. They'll lose their minds. I know, because I've lost my mind over it. Get to wheelbarrow. Ah, oh, son of a gun. We didn't lose the War of 1812. See, I told you, we're getting them riled up already. I'm here about the job. Whoops, did I click? I did click start the job. Okay, let's go. Alright, do work, please. Sixteen pounds? Yo! We can do this. We can still get home without dying. Oh, baby. Dude, I'm loaded. A little sweaty, though. I'm not having a drink with you, sir. Four pounds an hour? That's not bad. I, it isn't really that bad. I mean, it's like 1983, right? You can have a pint to get some energy back. Yeah, but I think we just, we'll, we'll have a big day tomorrow. Now I can actually take the bus into town. It's more than minimum wage now. <laughs> Uh. Wheelbarrow? Mm. What am I gonna do with the wheelbarrow, though, Jerry? I'm not taking it back to town. It's dark outside. As a Canadian, we didn't lose the War of 1812 because the country didn't exist for another 50 years. Well, I mean, that, that's true, but it's also like Canadians have a real chip on their shoulder about winning the War of 1812. Just hit them with the, you didn't win the War of 1812. And then they'll be like, what did you say to me? And you go, well, I mean, your country was Britain at the time. Their head will explode. I promise. Okay. We're going to... We're gonna take this bad boy into town. Skirt. Yo, this thing handles like a dream. I, I wish I could get in it. They should have this. This is a level three vehicle in Forza Eliminator. You're absolutely right. All right. Now, sir, I, I believe I need you to teach me how to pour a foundation. What do you want? Can you help me out? A wise man once said, don't build your house on the sandy land. And with that thought in mind, I think it's time you go to fixing your foundations. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. Now, it's quite a big job. You'll need to buy some tools. Get your hands on some supplies. And even learn how to lay a foundation. What tools do I need? Let's see. Master Wayne. You'll need a hammer and nails to assemble the foundation frame. A cement mixer 
to mix and pour the concrete foundation and a bucket to add water to the cement mixer. You can get all of these from Reggie's Tool Store just over the road from the Anchor Tavern. If you're tight on funds, remember to check the Job Center for work opportunities. But between me and you, I've seen that house number nine is having their back patio done and they happen to have just the supplies you're after. Anything else? Right, I'll get to it. Hold on, wait. Notebook, please. Give me that. <laughs> um, leg foundation. Get the foundation frame laid out in the correct area. Be sure to secure it with hammer and nails. Once your foundation... Okay, let's start with step one. To make the concrete foundation. No. Step one. Place an order through the phone outside the construction site. Wait for delivery. Unload the delivery using a pump truck. Tell Winston he can leave. All right. I do need some tools first. Sir, do you sell tools or supplies? How does this work then? Open that catalog and I'll place it on the table here in front of you. I really just need a hammer and nails. Get you a Emma and nails. Okay, you are supply store. You're the tool store. Hammers. Great for connecting and securing wood. Give me one of those, please. One. You don't, you don't sell nails? Yo, let's go. It comes with nails? Nails included, let's go, dude. But how do I get a foundation frame? Do you sell a foundation frame? Lay the foundations 13 pounds. I'll take one. I got 84. Let me go. Let, let me out. He said, okay, where does it show up? Winston drives it over? What time is it? Okay. We'll kill some time. And load up our wheelbarrow with stuff. Let's take the wheelbarrow over. I'm gonna I'm gonna rob the house. People were like, why don't you just rob for the supplies you need? Cause I'm Hey I can buy and rob. It's called double dipping, sweetheart. I should sue them. Did they have courts in 1980s England? No? I thought not. Yo, you know what I... Do you see what I see? A ladder, a ladder. Place it in my barrel. That is not a barrel, but a wheelbarrow. I mean, this is probably like a 30-pound piece of machinery right here. My god, he's done it. Aggregate. Strong concrete. Build I think we need sand, right? For foundations. You need it all? Yo, it's Austin! Not Apollo. Austin Powers. You need all three. Okay. Concrete is sand, aggregate, water, cement. You know what? Of course. I'm going to be furious if this works. Well, you put the weight on the ladder so that you counterbalance. Yo, Frosty, 13 roofs. Thank you. Thank you. 
for the cheer. I mean, if this works, this is this is legendary. Frosty bruise. I got the wrong thing, dude. I don't need any more blue. I need green. Oh, this the last one. Always the trickiest one. Okay. Wish me luck, boys. I think we're going to have to leave the ladder behind. Sadly, I think the ladder is going to have to be left behind. It was a good attempt. I mean, in real life, it would have worked. So it's really it's the game's fault. Let's go! Can you really only fit two things in here? It's just that easy. Okay, so here's the game plan, all right? What time is it? Three o'clock. Pub should just be kicking off right about now. I'm gonna leave me whip parked right outside. Go in and say, you know what? We're working. We gotta work enough to get a pint so we can get enough energy to work. So we can have more pints. Madam? What are you serving? I'll take a landlord super, please. And then just sink that bad boy right there. Cheers, boys! Bowel's 100%. Is that good or bad? Oh, it's bad. Yes, I will take a leak, please. Disgusting. That was the lady's toilet? That was my mistake. Oh! How's work? Steady, bud. Steady. Sound. There you go. And you know what? Last time I checked, it ain't midnight yet. Wash a couple more dishes. Oh my god, we're loaded, dude. 23 pounds burning a hole in my pocket. It's a fun day. Have a pint, take your wheelbarrow home, take a shower, start it all over again tomorrow. Yeah, I didn't need to wash my hands. I washed the dishes without gloves on. I did get hit by a car. You're not wrong. Is this my order? Okay, drop this bad boy off. Take one of these. Hayit! He's like, you haven't picked up your, <laughs> your foundation yet, dummy. Yeah, okay, I know you're tired, okay? It's called work, sweetheart. Look it up sometime. Oh my. We're gonna pass out.
This is the only opportunity for resident sleeper to actually function, please. Can I get some resident sleepers in chat? Do it tomorrow? Dude, I don't want the truck to go, though. He's another member of the working class. Just pass out in the wet, wet mud. They're all mad because I won best hog at the hog snarfing contest, but I'm not mad. That's normal. Remember to take it easy. Go to bed on time. Drink plenty of fluids. You collapse from exhaustion. Uh-oh. We still got our money. So today... We should build our foundation. Or no, we, we still need a bucket, right? So we can get water. A shovel and a bucket and a cement mixer. You still have a plank on your bed. You're okay. I'm assuming that was what you meant by my bed. That's why you use the quotations. Now I go. Yo! What is it? It said it was useless junk. Guess what? It's my useless junk. Put that in the skiff. Free money. Hey, you. You can go home now. I'm finished. You can go. Okay. You know what? We do it. We didn't take a shower last time. Take one of these real quick. Yeah, that guy clearly works a government job. <laughs> um. So do we have to like get rid of this garbage first? Do we have to get like a sledgehammer and get this stuff taken out of here? Maybe. <laughs> Guess nobody knows. It's the little square that's not concrete on the building. You mean this thing right here? We just get we gotta get this thing filled in? Yes. Get the foundation frame laid out in the correct area. Secure it with the hammer and nail. Okay, so you just need four pieces. You need four wooden stakes, and you're going to nail some timber, and then you're going to pour some concrete. Okay, very simple. So we need this. What? Is this a puzzle? Is a freaking puzzle? Then we gotta take one of these. You gotta hammer them first. Okay. Okay. Easy. Uh, <laughs> I don't think we have to hammer these. That does it. We're not gonna hammer a wooden stake into cement. I'm not sure about that one. Hello, I would like to put my hammer away. Oh, there you go. Okay, rotate. Oh, let's go. This is this is how you do it, dude. This is how you do it right here. Then you get the hammer. Let's go. Let's go. 
Let's go. Okay. So we need a bucket with some water. It's 4 p.m. What's wrong with the back steaks? Ah, oh, son of a gun, dude. Hold on. Anything worth doing is worth doing right. How do you how do you remove this plank? Can we use our claw hammer to pull the nail out? You cannot. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You can. Let's go. Anything worth doing is worth doing right. Get this garbage out of you. You're trash. Wood's broken. Okay. It's a puzzle, baby. Now we're talking. Although I'm like, I'm pretty sure this is not supposed to be right at the front. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong about that. I think I'm not. I think I'm wrong. I think I'm wrong about that. Okay. And you're going to take this. You're going to put this right here. I mean, dude, this is a good day's work. A grid has appeared. You know you're doing it right when a grid has appeared. Okay. Next step. Excuse me, I like to... Yeah. Uh, we need building supplies, please. No, we don't. Get out of here. Go have a pint. You've earned it. We don't need any of this garbage. Get out of here. Is your refrigerator running? We got to go into town and get a bucket, but for now we're just going to snooze with the door open. We need a cement mixer and a bucket. We need a cement mixer and a bucket. Okay. Oh, hey, what the heck is this? Looks like some kind of dang old bill. No, it's a it's a receipt. We got some aluminium. 50 pence worth. Okay. To the town, please. A shovel and a bucket and a cement mixer. You're a dirty boy. 70% hygiene. That's pretty good. Oh, he's taking the outside edge. He's got a great line coming into the chicane. Get in there, Lewis. DRS enabled. It's a record setting pit stop. Oh. Austin Powers. I need... Yeah, okay, nothing, dude. You look like Drew Carey's brother from the Drew Carey show. Cement mixer. I mean, we gotta go with the hand-powered. That's a big order, so I'll have it placed outside for you. Thank you. I'll like a cheap bucket, please. And... You don't, you don't sell shovels? Loose tools? Sold out! I mean, what the heck am I supposed to do with this thing? Oh my god. It's gonna be a long trip, boys. I don't, know, I don't know how to get it off my screen. It's just a nice reminder of, of thanks, you know? Nothing wrong with that. 
Yeah, we went, we went from a Mercedes to a Williams. But dum This was maybe the worst hi hat hit. But dum bum -tch. What do you say to someone you haven't spoken to in five years? Did you really mean to cut me off? Did you something and a something forget my number? And then you said I was on and something, 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 and I feel so low. Da da da. Somebody. Thank you. All right. You should really just... <laughs> After you, sir. Uh, that guy should deliver. Why did I expect real advice? I mean, like, that's really the question. Like, if you want advice and that sort of stuff, find a Discord where people who have never been in this situation give their opinion regardless based on media that they've consumed over the course of their life. And how they wish they had... How they wish it was done to them if they were in that situation. Okay, here we go. Thank you. Take the bus? They're not gonna let me take this wheelbarrow on the bus. Oh my god, now this is a Mercedes. Tell them it's a stroller and this is your baby. <laughs> Have you seen the Brendan Leipzig comments? Oh no. Brendan Le Leipzig is an ex-Vancouver Canucks player. Anytime an athlete that is not that good at their sport gets... Media attention for something they said, you know it's a problem. I do not know what he said, but <laughs> I can imagine that it's... It can't be great. Hold on, I gotta look at my notebook. Once you've got... Okay. Start mixing your concrete. To make the concrete, you'll need to get your hands on a foundation frame. Mix three things in the cement mixer. Okay. Doesn't seem that hard. We take the bucket. We go to the water supply. We turn the water supply on. Just like mom used to make. I think we're going to do the water last. <laughs> I think we're going to do the water last. All right. Sand. One full bag of sand. Hayit. One full bag of cement. Ha yeet. <laughs> One full bag of aggregate. And you know, we're going to hit you at the end of this with a. Uh, you just got to give me a second. We got to hit you with a. Ha yeet. He throws it so, so well. Then you grab the bucket. One full bucket of water. Beautiful. It's a little mineral heavy, but that's okay. One full bucket of water. How you? And then just mix this son of a gun up, dude.
That's weak concrete. As far as I'm concerned, that's an absolute win. Then how do we get the concrete into the... With the bucket? Can you just pour a bucket of concrete into the... Wheel the mixer over. And pour it in. Brother, what a sound. Okay. Once you've got your concrete mixed, wheel it over and start pouring it in. And we're done? Yo! Lay concrete foundation complete. Dude, that's amazing. I can't believe we did it. It's 5 p.m. Take a shower. Take a second shower. Close this bad boy up. That was a hard day's labor. Let's let's go take a little snooze here. That thank you is gonna stick around, huh? Okay, here's what I'm thinking. We're gonna <laughs> quit to menu. And then continue. Let's go. We're back. You hear that? Oh, I gotta turn the CRT off too. Okay. How'd that concrete do? I mean, that looks... This, it just looks different because there's age. There's just, a, it's just aged concrete. Um, I do have one idea. Because chat said, do this. <laughs> Didn't go as high as I thought. Do you think we get credit for the bags? Might as well give it a try. <laughs> Yeet, I suppose. What, you don't like my bags? I mean, I'm pretty impressed with us, honestly. Wait, is this a full one? Confirm not full. Okay. I think we have to go speak to the dude again. You know what? We're moving up in the world. We don't have to run anymore. Please take me to Sheffingham. Yes. I'll skip that then. <laughs> Ooh. Yes. Hello, I've poured my foundation. Can you help me out? Now that you've got some holes in your building you need to brick up the exterior walls you'll need to buy some tools get your hands on some supplies and even learn how to lay a foundation what tools do i need i think i did that last part you need a trowel to place and smooth the mortar a cement mixer to mix the mortar and a bucket to add all we need is a trowel dude the Anchor Tavern has all the bricks you'll be needing. Anything else? See you later, buddy. Dude, we're totally going to be able to do this. Let's go to the job center, though. How are we on? If we only got seven, seven dollars of cash each. Ah, it's a, it's a pull. Trowel. Oh, dude, we don't even need any. Uh... Sorry, we don't even need any. Great British pounds. We just we get a trowel right here. Thank you. Thank you. Take one of these. Call me in the morning. It's... I still think we should work today. But now that I... What, what is mortar made of? Maybe we shouldn't be doing this in the middle of the road. A 
Erecting a scaffolding is next. Oh, no. Create mortar using a cement mixer. Bro, what is mortar made of? With trowel in hand, collect the mixture and begin placing atop either brick or foundation. Smooth the placed mortar with alt fire. <laughs> and place a brick atop it. Sir, I need to speak to you, please. Great British pounds. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm ready, dude. But, like, how to brick up a wall? Cement, sand, and water into the cement mixer. So it's everything but aggregate. Oh, I'm not particularly particularly sure what the mixture is. All right. I understand. Dude, this is going to look horrible. I can't wait. Okay. I mean, I'm not carrying them back brick by brick. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to run back. We're going to get our wheelbarrow. We're going to fill this shit up with as much brick as we can. Then... We're going to work washing dishes. To make money. To buy sand and cement. I should have checked and saw what I had. You know what? I have one sand and one cement. But someone in chat said you need more sand. Like you need four to one sand to... Sand to cement. I could steal some, but I don't know if it's going to fit in the wheelbarrow. Hey, there's enough room on the on the road for both of us. Okay. Park my whip out front. I got my horses in the back. Sorry, I'm late for my shift. Okay, we can go pretty deep on this one. Oh my god. 24 pounds. Dude, we're rolling it. Okay, then the next step. What's all this standing in the anchor? Marry Jesus, I don't believe me eyes. Yeah, 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 yeah. What can I do for you? What are you... Just give me a pint of Landlord Super, please, madam. Bowels? Totally fine. And we're only 9% drunk. Imagine my power. When I get those numbers up. Yo, he's just... Just carrying him. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. I mean, 10 bricks. I'm no expert. I'm pretty sure that's not enough to make a wall. Let's go! Let's go! Although, I'll admit, it really does kind of beg the question. And the question is like, if I can carry this many bricks, why would I ever bother putting them in the wheelbarrow? But you know what? Let's just, like, reverse Jenga it. Ah, screw it. It's good enough. 
<laughs> I did my best. If you had the luxury to build your own house, would you? No. And, and, and politely. Design my own house? Maybe, but probably not. Actually do the construction myself? Oh god, no. That's a that's a disaster. Yeah, I don't even build my own PC. Okay. Building supplies, please. I need to purchase three bags of snad. Remember how long it took you and Kate to build that TV stand? Look, all I'm going to say, like, you're not wrong, but that TV stand was also horrible. That was not, like, a normal piece of Ikea furniture that took us, like, 10 hours. That thing was, like, from Hellraiser. Oh, we sold those empty bags. 161? Yo! That's pretty good. Yeah, the manual looked like one of those, like when you get a Marvel art book and it shows like a deconstruction of every screw in Iron Man's suit. That's what the TV table instructions look like. They were, they were absolutely terrible. Yes, I need three bags of sand, please. Too sweet. Sure, I'll take soft sand. It's so exp 20 bucks?! 20 pounds, sorry. That's ridiculous. That's actually like a full day's work. To get what? Sand? I like this. This will work. Take all these. It's 10 bags per order. Oh, son of a bitch. Don't stop till you're numb. Oh my god. What have I done? <laughs> it's like going on Amazon after you took an Ambien. I don't even think I can unload them, brother. Hey, well... Get a little bit of money. Hi, yeet. Whatever, dude. My property, my rules. He doesn't eat it very far. I mean, these bags are probably like 20 kilos each, but... Oh my god. You ever tried eating 25 kilos of snad? I've not, but stop making me, you know, remember that the gym's been closed for like two months. Keep emailing me. They're like, hey, you know, the gym's closed. We still have, like, online classes. Amazing. Can your online class get me squatting three <laughs> plates from home? I doubt it greatly. <laughs> All right. You're free to go. Get out of here, brother. What time is it? He's stuck. He's stuck on the sand, dude. <sighs> Sir, I'm sorry. I gotta go to bed. <laughs> it's not my problem. I don't have any other options, dude! 
Yo, how much for the pallets? That's not too bad. Oh no. Wet, wet mud. Sir, if you just, like, just give me a... Just give me a minute, okay? Like, I'm really trying. See, that one seemed like it was... Let's go! Oh no! Sorry, you got something wedged under your... It's... Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, 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 get out of here. Get out of here. Don't come back! Alright, um, thank you. I eat. Alright, well, there's 30% of my energy gone for today. Alright, alright. So we gotta just dump this. Is there a way you can just dump out this old cement? You just, like, pour it down the storm drain or something? Sure. We'll deal with that later. That's your patio now. Uh, okay. Four bags of sand. We're gonna, dude, this is getting bricked up. I'm ready. No, four. Four bags. <laughs> oh my god. I feel like the truck sound is still out there. Yeah, it's going. It's it's going in there. It's because he's still there. He crashed. Oh! That might screw up the game a little. You ruined his life. <laughs> mm okay. There you go. Three things of sand. The one thing is cement. This thing better have a hundred liters in it. Yo, let's go. It does. Alright, that's one you really don't want to breathe. And then, uh, buckets over here. It's still got water in it, dude, because of the rain! Get out of here. Get out of here, stinky. I, w I don't want rain water. I'm not building my place with rain water. Are you insane? Give me five spurts from the soda stream. There you go. Mix it up. I just hope this says mortar. No mix. You didn't put water in it. Did I miss with the water? Oh, I, I just literally... I think I just dropped it on the ground and spilled it. Give me about three spritzes. Okay, that's perfect. Sure, that's probably good enough. Standard mortar! A legendary performance. 
I got flies around me. Then. Take one of these. Look, get, get your, get, get your trowel out. Place, pick up, mortar. They always got a lot of it. Whenever they got one of these things, they always got a lot of it. Then you spread it like this. And you... That kind of looks right to me. But you got to right click it to flatten it. Yo! Let, let's go. Okay. Give me one of these. And two of these. Yes. Yes. Okay. Then... Pull this bad boy out. We still got the pre-existing mortar, dude. You also need to butter the sides. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> butter the sides. I think the sides will self-butter once we put it on. Yeah, self-buttered sides, dude. Oh, no! I think I need more mortar mix. Okay. Oh, there you go. Dude. Why did I get so good? This one is, like, cursed, though. Resize it? You can resize this? What is happening, dude? It's incredible. 5 p.m. I, I would have thought we wouldn't have even built a foundation over the course of this segment. Instead... Hey, uh, you guys... Uh, you got something wrong with your bricks there? There you go. That's what you're looking for. Sad to say the right click is not working. You made the butter too small. I understand. Put the bricks away, please. And then take off some of the butter. Butter has to be larger. Oh, that's, that's large butter. That's large butter. Too large. How about this? <laughs> we just want to... just want to place the butter. You know what? I think this is a tomorrow problem. I can't see very well. <laughs> I don't know if I can take out the middle butter. Well, we'll have to find out tomorrow. It's going to settle. Ah! You have to right click then left click the butter. Okay, okay, thank you. Give me my trowel, please. Finds right click left click. Right click, left click. Right click, left click. I don't think it's working. 
I'd like to remove the bricks, please. Maybe there's no room on the pallet. You know what? My hammer, please. Start beating on it, dude. <laughs> Did the butter set? I don't know, man. Well, okay. If the butter set, then no regrets. Here we go. Put, put some more... Don't be shy, put some more. I don't know what, I mean, I guess we're gonna butter this up. Wall's gonna be a little fricked up, but. <laughs> Not that much I can do about it. Yeah, I don't know, it's a little smaller on the inside than on the outside, but like, you know how it is, the butter didn't line up. Now try to take the side butter. No! It's not gonna work. Look, I'm gonna tell you it's gonna be a little fricked up for a second. Once we get it going though, this is gonna be right as rain. I do need some more bricks though. <laughs> Look, it's gonna be fine. Yeah, the guy is still there. It's all right. Next time we stream this, next time we stream this, we'll just start over from zero. And we'll do it better this time. It is like my summer car. Bricks, 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 bricks. How much money we got? I don't think we have enough to buy a sledgehammer, unfortunately. And uh, they felt they're falling through the briefcase, huh? Or the, why do I keep calling it? Brain, brain broke. Send help. Almost. Ladies and gentlemen. Please just carry them in your hands. You know it's tool use that separates us from the beasts. There you go. Good old fashioned British ingenuity. I'll race you. I swear to God, if you break check me and make me lose all my bricks, I'm gonna be pissed. Brick chick. New Zealanders be like, Brick chick. Thank you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> gets me every time. Okay. Yes. Alright, alright. How, how are we gonna get this to work? Um, no, 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 no. I got it. 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 Honestly, like... I got it. It looks a little bit like this. You just put way too much mortar on this son of a bitch right here. And then you... A little piece. A little piece. Because you gotta... You know what? I think we gotta do it like this. You're not gonna... I'm just gonna level with you, Chad. You're not gonna like this part. But we gotta find a way to fill in this hole. Otherwise, the rain's gonna get in.
Why not? It's dry? Not anymore. <laughs> what? What are you doing? It's f freaking grab the give me give me one of these. Give me one of these. <laughs> this is the only way. Freaking sledgehammer is too expensive, dude. Only way we can get out of here is... Get these freaking bricks out of here. It, it's working. That's the messed up part. Is it working? What happened to my trowel? Oh, there it is. Can I... Can I take off the butter now? You still can't take off the sides, dude. <laughs> what the heck have I done? Look at what is this? I built like bookshelves. I built some IKEA bookshelves. That's all I got. And I can't even pick up the bricks. The bricks are like still part of the wall. You're right. There's only one way to do this. Well, it's just time to get a pint. Um. Well, I think that's going to do it. I've honestly got no hard feelings. I love the game. It's a little goofy. You're gonna honk at me. You haven't moved in four days, but you're gonna honk at me? You have the audacity to honk at me, sir? Get me out of here. Is there anything I can... You know what? That's a great point. What if we what if we order another delivery? He's already out. He's already out making a delivery. Oh, we turned into dusk temporarily. I'm sweating blood. All right, so we basically like broke the game. Just take a little snooze. Anyway, <laughs> we tried, we tried. Someone said throw something at his truck and maybe it'll work. Okay, hold on. Not this, these are valuable. This is trash. Modern problems require modern solutions. Well done. <laughs> well done. This is still fucked, though. That was very unexpected. Well, anyway, let me go <laughs> see. You know what? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. If it worked on the truck... <laughs> this 
the sound. I like how he holds it like a paper airplane, too. No, I think it's still screwed. It's just a wall that's exclusively butter, dude. I think maybe a sledgehammer would work, but... This is why we do w custom wood builds. Anyway. <laughs> Let me... Lay 